Hey, this is Reggie with Vista Social. This video is gonna be focused on publishing cues and how we can help you save a lot of time when scheduling by setting those up. Let's jump over to the desktop and let's start maybe by talking a little bit about what are publishing cues. If I head over to my calendar, you probably already have some sort of cadence to your strategy, meaning you know the days of the week, the times of those days, and what categories each of your posts are going to be. And instead of choosing a specific date and time for each of your posts, you can let Vista Social automate that scheduling piece for you. So let's look at how we can set this up. We'll start over on settings and we'll go to our connected profiles. And from there, let's select my Facebook, Matthew's Coffee. Now this is that fictitious coffee shop that we've been working through in the last couple of videos. Right here at the bottom, you're gonna see the publishing cues. Well, right now it's empty. So with my strategy, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays are kind of my cadence for this profile. On Mondays, I'm gonna be publishing closer to the afternoon, something around 5.30 p.m. And what kind of post is this gonna be? Well, according to my strategy, on Mondays, I'm gonna be publishing industry news for my coffee shop. So I'll go ahead and write in uh, coffee nudes, right? This is the label associated with what type of post this is going to be. Now my Wednesday posts are gonna be a little different. On Wednesdays, I'm gonna take some of my user-generated content and I'm gonna publish those, right? Testimonial type things where users talk about my brand. And that's gonna be a little bit earlier in the day, around 7.30 in the morning. I'm gonna go ahead and we have one created UGC. And again, I can type in whatever label I want here. This is essentially setting up a category to that time slot. And I can do the same thing for Fridays. I'll head over here and maybe on Fridays, I've got my promotions. So this is where I talk about my brand. Hey, this is the deal that we've got going on. Go ahead and check us out, right? Do a little bit of shameless plugs for my brand in itself. And now I've set up the cadence for my posts. Now right here from this setup screen, I can use the filters to more easily navigate between the different labels that I have set up. So I know that coffee news is once a week and promotions are on Fridays and user generated content is on Wednesdays. Now you can add as many labels and as many time slots as you want. So how is this going to help you? Well, let's go ahead and head back to the publisher. We'll schedule our post. Let's start with Instagram and Facebook because I've set up my publishing cues for both of these for right now. I'll go ahead and use one of my saved captions. And if you don't know how to use this just yet, check out our video on saved captions. It'll help you save a ton of time. So I've crafted my post. This one is a promotion. And so I'm gonna head to add to queue instead of schedule. Now, since this post is about promotion, I'll choose to queue based on the promotion label that I've created. Now, automatically Vista Social knows based on that frequency of Wednesdays for my Instagram account on Fridays for my Facebook page, this is the next time that we'll be publishing this post too. So as you can see, it's not just about one profile, you can do this to as many profiles as you're managing to be able to save a ton of time when you're scheduling your posts. Now, since I've already set up queue labels for my profiles, I can go into something like the Instagram visual planner and here on the top right, this new gear icon will show up, allowing me to determine which key label do I wanna use as I'm scheduling content. Let's say I go with a coffee news label, and now I come in, bring in this video, drag it into our visual planner. Well, it now knows that based on all the time slots I've created using the coffee news label, this new post should go out on the 24th. And if I bring in another one, maybe this one this time and drag that in, it also knows that, okay, the next one should be then May 1st. And as I swap around, maybe I wanna do some food content next, I can drag that in. Now you can see that below here. So this is a really quick way for you to take your content pillars, your categories and strategy, attach them to specific labels for the queue, and then schedule content more quickly with Vista Social. Now you can even filter the calendar based on specific queue labels to help you get organized and plan in advance. Now make sure you check out our support center. We've got a ton of helpful resources to help you save time with all of these awesome tools. If you get stuck along the way, make sure to reach out to our support team. We're here to help.